Trump broke protocol last night by ditching his press corps, going out to dinner with his family unannounced. And after getting his first daily presidential briefing along with Trump, Mike Pence is meeting today with Vice President Joe Biden. ABC's Janae Norman has the latest from D.C. Donald Trump out of the public eye, but back on Twitter. Writing the process for picking cabinet members is very organized, though it appears to be anything but. Cracks beginning to show as key members of the transition team purged. Former Congressman Mike Rogers, one of Trump's top national security advisors, abruptly resigning, reportedly pushed out. This is Governor Chris Christie was ousted. Ben Carson distanced himself from the transition and a low level staffer gone for making an inquiry into security clearances for Trump's children. Senior advisor Kellyanne Conway forced to respond. That I don't know. I only know what I read in the paper. I just I just know that uh that was never a formal request. At the same time, criticism continues over Trump's pick for chief strategist Steve Bannon, former chair of Breitbart News. People didn't vote for Donald Trump so that he could bring a white supremacist into the White House. Late Tuesday, the president-elect leaving reporters scrambling, heading out to dinner with his family after telling the press he was in for the night. The move breaking tradition of always having journalists on hand to report the president's whereabouts. We and the protests haven't let up. In the nation's capital, hundreds of students taking over Pennsylvania Avenue, shutting down the Lincoln Memorial. Too young to vote, but making sure their voices are heard. We want to let Donald Trump know that he cannot divide us with his racism, sexism, all that bigotry. And the president-elect tweeting, if the election were based on total popular votes, he would have campaigned more in New York, California, and Florida, saying he would have won even bigger and more easily. As of now, Hillary Clinton is up in the popular vote.